I've always been told to fear the unexpected. Welcome it. Let it come. I thought it would never happen, but it did. My friend Harper, Joe, and I were good friends. Often, they would get in trouble. We would always get this idea, this thing, that we would discover something. Many times, they would sneak out at night and go into the woods. We thought it was harmless until I turned 15. So Harper and Joe entered the woods with some girls. The football captain was there with us too. It was Joe's 15th birthday. We decided to go into the woods and act wild. Like any other teenager, Harper, the captain, his name is Patrick, and the girls were drinking, smoking, and getting drunk every night, which I didn't know until that day. Joe was just following them, letting them lead the way. They heard rumors of mass murders and people being scalped in that area. So they decided to go check it out, bringing silenced guns, flashlights, and knives. They decided to check it out. I wanted to come, but I was always that boy who says no to dangers. They sometimes called me a buster. As they were approaching the river, their flashlights started to have problems. They would flash on and off for no reason. Despite the flashlight problem, they continued their so-called expedition. My friends and the other people reached the other side of the river. So they decided to stop for their annual booze and smoke break. Bad decision. As soon as they popped open the bottles, Patrick was pounced on and was killed by a hammer. He said his last words in agony. The next morning, I was told that Harper, Joe, and the girls were missing. Patrick was found in a dumpster. But on his body was a note saying, I'm after you, Jake. So I'm writing this as I'm paranoid by the note in my closet, hearing noises at the door. <laughs>